All right, so I have talked to everyone about uh, all the people and all the items I found. On my list, I have Felix and Harshang. Oh, you can also see them being listed as the next suspicious thingy. So I guess we're going to go to Harshang. Is that actually your name? Hawk, Hawk, Hawkshaw. Jeez. All right, then. Uh, suspicion. This little microscope thing? You said you used it to search the greenhouse. And this would make perfect sense. Mm -hmm. If you knew what my client had asked me to find. I know. Of course, I still have no intention of disclosing that information. That's okay. You're such I a know cheese hawk shot. Anyway. Don't worry. We already worked out what you're searching for. Exactly. Um, what has Hawkshaw been hired to find? The Golden Beetle. You're not as hopeless as you look. Thanks. Why would you admit so, that if it's a secret? that's what you're looking for in the greenhouse? This beetle? Surely even you can understand the logic of it. The greenhouse is home to a great many insects. Correct. The gardener could have easily kept the beetle hidden in there. Well, Fitz said you questioned him, but didn't actually search the greenhouse. Mm-hmm. Mm. He's not exactly the type to appreciate subtlety. He simply didn't notice that I was using my microscope. What wow. do you reckon, Grimoire? Why did she I lose it anyway? Fact, she didn't use the microscope in the greenhouse. Um, I don't think it's that. It's broken and doesn't work. It's not a microscope at all. Probably? It's not a microscope at all. All of a sudden, Detective Grimoire is some kind of expert on microscopes. Oh, that might actually be it. Um, the handheld microscope is part of a telescopic lens. I do think so. I do think because normally telescopes have like a smaller thingy on it so you can better aim it at whatever the heck you're looking at. So where did, where did we find this thing? I can't remember. What? I don't know where we found it. The handheld oh, microscope well, that's not is it. a part of a telescopic lens. So Hawkshaw lied about it. Almost. Maybe just change one thing. The handheld microscope okay. is a part of a telescopic lens. So Fifi um, stole it. Nope. Okay, so that one was correct. Made entirely out of... Scraper Fifi to use. Was created by Fifi to use a teles... What? Fake glass lens, Fifi's eye gear, magnifying glass. According to Fifi users, according to Harshank users. I don't know. Okay, um, what did I have this on? Is part of. Let's change this one and see. The handheld microscope, according to Hawkshaw, if uses a telescopic lens. So this one was Hawkshaw right or not? Lied about. A bit lame. Almost. Oh. Maybe just change one thing. So we need to change this one to whatever it is. Um, according to Fifi uses, was created by Fifi to use. The handheld no. microscope was created by Fifi to use a telescopic lens. So Hawkshaw lied about it. Almost. Maybe just... It's made entirely out of a telescopic lens. That just doesn't sound right. It's part of sounds right. According to Hawkshaw uses... Wait, didn't I? Which one did I just do? Well, the guess I'll just go through all of them. Created by what? The handheld there we go. According to Fifi, uses a telescopic lens. So oh, Hawkshaw lied about it. Duh. I'm inclined Fifi said to that Fifi. it does when not. When it comes to stuff like this. Hawkshaw, why did you lie about owning a telescope? Huh. Yeah, whatever. That's whatever you Fifi said. You were a child. What did you aspire to become? Uh, a detective, naturally. Emperor of the Galaxy. I wanted to be an astronomer. Really? I harbored a desire to understand the secrets of the wider universe. A fool's errand, to be sure. But a seductive one. At 15, Yikes. I decided instead to apply my intelligence to the world around me. And so, I became a detective. But the yearning for elusive knowledge is a powerful force. So you just I lost the thing? I keep it with me. 
Sorry, but we're way off track. What's the deal with the little telescope? A memento from my okay. childhood. Little more than a toy. Why did you bring it with you? And why I did you lose it? that it was Professor Pointer who had hired me. I dared to consider it something of a planetary alignment. I had hoped he might sign my telescope. An Aww. extremely childish indulgence, I admit. I never would That's have okay. guessed. Hold on. You're admitting you didn't use it in the greenhouse then? Correct. As it happens, I have no need to search the greenhouse to such a degree. Professor Pointer doesn't consider the gardener a suspect in our theft investigation. Okay. So, who is your suspect? Things Freya. have become complicated. My lead yep. suspect nice. is your murder victim. Yup. Thought so. Okay, so that's um, Hawkshaw done. We have as next... Felix has something to tell us, hopefully useful. But we'll see. Hello, poor dude my jig. So, about this paint we found in your room. Nothing suspicious about it. I used it to, to paint, obviously. Totally normal thing to do. We never said it was suspicious. Yeah. Come on then, out with it. What exactly are you accusing me of? Um, it doesn't seem that it is his paint. It's not your paint bot. Did you take it from somewhere else? What on earth? It's definitely mine. I even have proof. Look, the lid matches the ones on all my other paint pots. End of discussion. Okay. That's not the end of the discussion. We need a clue to compare with Felix's red paint. Something to prove who it actually belongs to. Yeah, to Freya probably. Uh, something to compare directly with the red paint pot. Um, Freya's paint, I guess. Let's take a closer look at this. What is your brain up to? Um. Oh. The symbol. Oh. Um, the symbol is different. These are all wavy. <laughs> Not exactly the same. Um, but the lids were swapped to hide it. Okay, this might be it. Freya's nope. red paint pot is exactly the same as Felix's red paint pot, but the lids were swapped to hide it. Almost. Maybe just change one. Uh, it was stolen and replaced with Felix red paint, but the lids probably. Freya's red Heck yeah, paint pot nailed it. Was stolen and replaced with. Felix's red paint pot, but the lids were swapped to hide it. That red paint is from Freya's supplies, not yours. Swapping the lids doesn't hide what you did. Why are you bothering me about paint anyway? And none because of this one of them was blood. Murder. Oh no, here we go. Um, what? Why is Felix stealing Freya's paint relevant to the murder? Because. Uh, red paint, no, blood was used to fill up the red paint pot after Freya used it. Blood was used to fill up this red paint pot after Freya used it to paint Flora. Nope. Ooh, just a straight up nope. Not even close. Wasn't there something strange inside Freya's red paint pot? Yes, blood. She used to. Blood? No. This red paint pot was somehow filled with blood. Um, by Freya's salary? After, after Freya used it to paint Flora. No, during, because it was on the painting as well, and emptied out onto the floor. Yeah, did you ever see a corpse? This red paint pot was somehow filled with blood and emptied out onto the floor. Almost. Maybe just change one thing. Okay. Before, yeah, 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 that must this be it. Red paint there we go. Pot was somehow filled with blood before Freya used it to paint Flora. Oh, that, uh, that's definitely something. Right. Fine. Yeah. 
here's the story. Do tell. I was busy working on uh, a project when I suddenly realized I had run out of red paint. So you just use some blobs, a why not? There uh, was the time pressure. So I politely asked Freya if I could borrow hers. Just for a little while, you know. Perfectly reasonable request. Uh, but she said no. I tried to explain why I needed it, but she didn't seem to care. So, uh, well... I got off my I finger. I took Freya's red paint pot and swapped it with my own empty one. You went empty. into her room? Not my proudest moment, but it's just paint. I didn't touch anything else. And the paint pot you left behind was definitely empty? Uh, quite. I have absolutely no idea how it got blood in it. Is that why Freya didn't asking, let you borrow you get her red, red paint, paint because anyway? hers was also blood? Is also blood? I was trying to finish this in time for Flora's birthday. I needed red to paint the final details. Could you not have just used a different color? Out of the question. It had to yeah, be red and the bird. white. If you managed to finish it, why haven't you given it to Flora yet? No. Uh, well, I decided Stuff happened. against it in the end. Oh. After what happened, seemed a bit uh, insensitive. Ooh. Let's go over what we know about the crime scene. Sure. I'm not sure why we have to do that there. But sure. Uh, the crime scene. We know a little more about the crime scene now. So... What do you think? Was Freya stabbed by her own painting? No. Um, was designed to match the painted flora. Feather found outside. We didn't find a feather outside. The painted ink dip feather was designed to match a real knife. To resemble a bloody knife, something like that. The painted ink dip feather was designed to match a real knife to resemble a bloody knife. Nope. Oof. Uh, was used to paint the red tip off. Where did the blood come from and how was it used? The blood from the paint pot was used to paint the ink tip feather. To prove the existence of magic, what the hell? Hide the evidence to distract Freya so I could stab Freya to resemble a bloody knife. I guess. Blood from the paint pot yeah. was used to paint the red tip of the painted ink dip feather to resemble a bloody knife. Okay. I think you're right. Can't decide if I'm disappointed or relieved. Hmm. I have a question. What does it do though? Why? Yeah, exactly. Why? Either it's a very strange coincidence or somebody set it up. Somebody deliberately put blood in the paint pot. And hid that feather after the crime. Why? Oh, yeah, of to course, Flora us. was Possibly. carrying, holding well, the feather. It Possibly. Flora is the only person who could have hidden the feather, unless someone took it from her. Yeah. Well, let's go over what we do know. The door was locked the whole time. It until stayed it locked until Fitz kicked it down. Normally, it can only be opened from the inside. Pointer said he couldn't see Freya from his telescope. But he did yeah. see Flora lying by the window. So whatever got Freya got Flora too? Except Flora survived. She didn't get a stab wound like Freya did. Hold on. If there was Meteor. no knife, then what did stab Freya? Uh, it could be anything. It might not even be important. How is it not important? Right now, I'm less interested in the what and more interested in the how. The angle okay. of Freya's wound suggests she was stabbed at a perfect right angle. That is, from directly in front of her. Yeah, but the painting but is... she was standing right up by the canvas. Yeah. Somehow, Freya ended up lying on her back, still perfectly in line with a painting. Maybe something went through it. Through the painting? We didn't reach, Jack, but I didn't hole? Yeah, okay, see well, anything. How about this? How do we know Freya was stabbed before she fell over? Maybe her being stabbed and her falling over are completely unrelated. But she fell over and then was stabbed? Then it must come from the attic. Uh, let's have a look at the attic then, I guess. Because that's straight above. But how the heck did she fall over? Just an earthquake or something? Um, what is that? Not sure. 
looks some like it might attach to something. Didn't we check that already? Yes. What are you? I still don't know what the heck I'm supposed to do with this thing. Um, but there is a hole here. There's plenty of holes, actually. Where's that light coming from? Well, it's just daylight, I think. There's I'm a decent gap yes. between those four. See? Interesting. That's basically exactly there. Something fell down, maybe? I don't know. That's all you do with that information? Where's that light coming no, from? Just There's a decent gap between those floorboards. What? You're like, ha, ha, ha. What? Uh, sure. The outline of Freya Fellow. Looks like she fell onto her back. Yeah. There's a simple patch of blood. Right in the middle. Yeah, I wouldn't call that the middle, but no sure. No signs of a struggle. That's weird. What? Her feet were right up by the canvas. Mm-hmm. So? Pretty close. So she was probably standing really close to the canvas when she fell. Mm-hmm. Let's check the case file again. Sure. That's way further. Uh, murder victim. Yeah, la 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 la. Sure. Yes, but why am I supposed to do this? This is way for a distance. If that's even relevant, I have no idea. Do we need to do this thing? Check the case for now. Um, oops, not what I meant. Um. Am I supposed to click on anything here? There's also no blood here, but yeah, this might just be a irrelevant picture. Hello. Um. Hello. We are going to check what is being suggested to do next. We should search Poppy's room. Why though? It's a bit random. The tutor. Uh, is there anything with you special now? We already did the yeah, suspicion, I need right? To confirm something with you. Confirm Papa. away. What can you tell us about this cassette tape? Is it yours? Uh, oh yeah, that was the first thing I'm pretty sure. Um double check. Dun 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 dun. Dun dun dun. Also dun. Um we have checked that guy. We have checked the glass. What are we supposed to check here? Pretty sure I found everything. Did we check the window? It's just daylight, right? What else would it be? Whoa, okay. Books. All right, you got your wish. Spooky murder mansion. Spooky murder mansion. We've been been through that. Um, piano. It's one of those big pianos. Don't touch it. Why not? Might be haunted. Okay. I'm not sure what to do here. Is it still telling me to visit Poppy's room? Uh, did we hear some kind of melody while in Flora's tower? I don't know, baby. Uh, what about this thing? Does it make a different sound now? Also, even if, what is this supposed to do? I would imagine that because of the melody, it would show something here. But this does not. Tell me anything. This just seems like the general blobbage. Like, uh... What's that character called? Fine, right, let's go back to Floor's room. Check what the melody is. And see if... Uh... The blob machine wants to do something here. Doesn't really do much. What else do you tell me? Did we hear some kind of melody while in Flora's Tower? Flora's Tower. Wouldn't that be... Yeah, Flora's Tower. Sure. We did try this with both cassettes. So I don't think there's any point trying it again. Maybe on the attic. Did we the check that? The attic's directly above us, right? Yep. Yeah. Is there anything else the here? Attic. No. 
Uh, block machine. Anything? No. I don't know, man. Do we go back to the attic? The whole room is a strange... Yeah, there might be a reason for that. Freya's painting supplies. We did check that out already. We talked to her? I don't know. We already did the suspicion. We did everything as far as I know. Door already That's checked out as well. That's the only door in and... It's also... Sure is. Guessing it's not... Supposedly, Freya was working on the painting when she was... Mm -hmm. It looks like she was still holding her... Didn't even get a chance to clean her brush. Nope. Mm, did check that as well. Really? Now you're gonna tell me to go somewhere else again. There was some kind of melody by the main entrance. Is this the main entrance? Yeah, this is just... Okay. Uh, Fine. Let's uh, check this thing here. Is this supposed to mean anything? Is this different? Maybe. Like, how am I supposed to... <laughs> Uh, uh, let's ring the doorbell. Oh. Okay. Is there anything else where we can click to do music? What is this supposed to mean? Do we see that anywhere? Um. It is a symbol. Oh! What? Huh? Wind chimes. Silent. All right. Wind chimes. Uh, so if we go back to this thing, does it have the doorbell now? Yes, it does. All right. Okay. Uh, the item that we have does show a doorbell. So doorbell is number one then, maybe? The symbols represent melodies which cause a reaction from the wooden toy. Okay, so what the hell are the lips supposed to be? Assuming those are... Lips. Uh, let's go for the piano. I was just there. Do we at Lake's Edge? We were there, and it was just the uh, chimes. But I couldn't ring him, right? What? Wind chimes. Silent. Wooden wind chimes. Did make sound? What? Oh, the birds. Okay. Sure. Two more then? But what the hell else is making sound? How am I supposed to know this? Holy moly. The poppish room still has something that makes sound? No, no, because I would say, ooh, we heard some sound. So there's something here I haven't clicked yet, I guess. What? Oh, oh, oh! Poppy's room, not where Poppy actually is. What a dingus. Oh, this definitely makes a sound. We already solved it. Okay, well, that's not it, I guess. No. Uh, there has the piano. Jeez. For this kind of, you know, these ones that stand upright. Oh. That's not. Wait, did I ever check that a out? A big glass door leads out into a garden. There's a little mechanism by. Huh. Oh. 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 This is probably the same as. Wait. No. There's less. Less sun. Uh, I think. Something like this. Let me note it down. Actually, I think this might be the combination for the other ones, because the other ones might have had moons, like the. the uh, icons were different. Not gonna I do guess anything. We'll come back later. Yeah, yeah, we will. Um, so maybe there might not be a sound here, but we found this. I really haven't looked this room through a lot, Sheet have music. I? It's Presum only a few notes. I'd yeah, it's been framed though. Must be important for some reason. Huh. Really did not check this room well. <laughs> A single red rose. How very... Yeah, weird. Uh, what's this Illuminati Various painting? Hand. What do you think those symbols mean? Yeah, hopefully, nothing. Anything in the wardrobe? Dresses, mostly. I know. 
ever realize there are so many shades of black. Shades of black. Uh, here, have a sock. Just a bunch of clothes on the floor. Nothing weird about that. To you. Haha. Uh -huh. um, okay, so I am going to his room. So we can finally inspect the garden. Jeez. Uh, 